In our Health Watch report, 1 million Americans have total joint replacement every year. Local 3's Shelly Bota has some guidelines that could help you decide if it's time to say goodbye to your aching joints. Most people struggling with osteoarthritis in their hips and knees are able to manage the condition with weight loss, medication, cortisone injections, and physical therapy. But if those options aren't working, how do you decide if and when replacement is the right move for you? 63-year-old Christine Hoffman has the energy of a woman half her age. But a lifetime of running, gymnastics, and dancing took a toll on Chris's hips. Like I couldn't cross my leg you know, my right leg over my left side anymore. I, I just, there were just a lot of things, little by little, that I was losing. Why don't you lie down for a second? Let's take a peek. Orthopedic surgeon Kamala Littleton specializes in hip and knee replacements. Here are the three questions to ask yourself if you think it's time for new joints. First, is pain ruining your mood most of the time? If it is making you angry or sad or something like that, I think it's time to address it more aggressively. Do you need constant medication to relieve joint pain? Have you stopped doing the things you love? You don't want to go to a movie because you know it's going to be so miserable when you get up after the movie or fly on an airplane or go on a vacation. Dr. Littleton says hip replacement surgery is less invasive these days, making recovery easier and faster. Knee replacement recovery is tougher and requires pre-planning. Will you have to navigate steps? Who will drive you to physical therapy? You've got to do therapy. You've got to fight like a little Marine through this process. And if you do that, you can be very, very successful. Chris Hoffman had her right hip replaced in 2005 and her left one done last year. I'm just not ready to hang it up. I'm not. I, I'm, I can fix this. On her feet and ready for another adventure. Doctors say because the artificial joints commonly last about 20 years, you really don't want to replace too early. On the other hand, if you wait so long that you are not mobile, you'll lose strength and endurance, making recovery more difficult. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Shelley Botot, Local 3 News.